Right, let's continue this. Or wrap this up if possible in this next, next couple of streams. Like you conquer all the borders, the up to Germania and the Dacia here and all that. Do still have to conquer half of the Middle East though. Maybe a bigger issue. Those factions over there are a bit um, a bit tougher to crack, especially Egypt and this Lucid Empire. Always, we'll see how we go. Okay, let me see where we left off. We are at war with these guys. Athenians and Spartans are just looking at me, praying like vultures. What a big battle there. Ready for battle. I think I wanna get this guy back over there to recruit while this guy besieges there. This guy's gonna have to like come down here and uh, it's gonna leave us exposed though. Right, we do have a fleet defending that, never mind. Oh god, this is so fucking spread out, I don't like this one bit. This is even worse. You know what, I might just uh take this bit here then piece them out if I'm honest because these guys are just rating strike at this point we hunger for battle a little supply issue here Let's deal with that. Ready for orders. Maybe we have nothing up north against all these tribes, which is even worse. There's t four, four different ones. Let me check. Okay, we did conquer the whole north. The G Egyptians, I think, uh, cancelled their trade agreement with me, so I need to get this army over there. On the move. Ready for further orders. Just sit here. It is an honor to serve. Right, the... Empress has a fleet in here somewhere. Steady as we go. The waves still beckon. And we're recruiting another fleet here. That's gonna be done in a turn. Good. I need to take out the Empress fleets here. So they don't attack any of these settlements down here with these. Let me see. I do still have some money to spend.
Okay, let's check the political situ situation. The Green Party is already getting pissed off. That's not good. Okay, there it is. There wasn't uh, someone who can actually do that, though. Check the unmarried guys like this guy. Get a weave. Gravitas is gonna help as well. This really did become a political game in the end. As I said before, no wonder Rome fell. <laughs> Let's see if we can still send a diplomat. Yes, we can. Let's send one to Egyptians. Can you go back up here? See what's happening? Nothing. Good. guys are playing for a turn. Oh, I have turns for this one. Okay, let's see what happens. Hope as I can see you singing to them. Next turn. It is in your eyes, in your stench, and you are right to fear. War comes. Speak of the devil. Okay. And they thought they can win this. I mean, they're gonna... Well, all the resolve's not gonna yield a good result for me, but uh, I guess I'm gonna do the battle anyway. Right, this guy isn't leveled up, and he's not gonna have a lot of morale on the units. Well, we should be able to hold these with a couple of units, then just uh, sw yeah, two ox uh, two of the eagle cohort should be able to, with the help of the these two, should be able to hold that. 
Then we can just go back around them and attack them from the flank. Why is my army turned that way? What the fuck game? here for now. Okay, looks like they're gonna deploy most of their troops here. Medium, medium. Very light. Heavy. They don't look heavy to me, especially when your face is that. Uh, I actually didn't want to do the thing we didn't last did last time with Spartans for the hoplites. Just let them come in so we can flank them. Yeah, let's do that. That might be a better idea. Not gonna be as big of a slog as it usually is. There they be naked. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Mm, they should copy a lot of tattoos from each other. <laughs> You're not gonna cross? What? Oh god. Light. Heavy. Light. Light. These guys should be able to hold on. Let's actually peel off two of these up here. Two sets of cam over there as well because I feel they're gonna like squeeze through somewhere. you not will slink the whole army through there if I haven't paid attention one of our units has used all its ammunition
seems like I picked the wrong one to fire over there. Not. Can I actually flank them? Let's see. Look at that. Look at that Congo line. Okay, it doesn't seem like we can though. There goes a cap through that. Now, as for here, I, do, I am kind of waiting for them to actually both cross or the entire army to cross so I can encircle them with the troops on the flanks. This would depend more of their army here. I would place two of these over there. This one got 160 kills, 200, 153. Not bad. Equities! No, 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 D don't do that, come on. Could you, could you stop him? Should be able to take care of them. I almost want to give them way here to go because fighting in the shell of waters here is going to be annoying. Yes, run, you fools, run. There's going to be no escape. Let's try and give them a little space here. Yeah. 
Make sure we can't do any massive flanks here. What the f... Of course they're just gonna squeeze through like nothing. I call it nice through butter. I like this, I'm not going to be able to wipe them out. Oh, eh, maybe once they start retreating, I can squeeze my cab through and just mop them up. Not that highly unlikely. Of course, most of these are fully wetted and all that. The fuck are you doing? Lining off, lining up to show off. Crash cheeks? Are they gonna moon my men? Is that a thing? Brave Romans to a man. Okay, I get I get to try and get the cav across here. get hit when they are in the trees that's not good the brave, ready for orders. come on just try and get through come on very light spears uh, the cab should be fine against those something else to be honest are confusing the hell out of me. And these trees are not making it easy to hunt them down either. Come down. Now. 
Oh god, there's so many of them. You catch these two. Good, thankfully good. Oh, by the time I get get around to playing uh, Last Lines, Last Allegiance, Last Lines, whatever the Lord of the Rings mod is called, should be get a bunch of updates. So might be even better. Catch up to them. That's going to be most that I can catch. The good KD. Except we're going to have another army if they're stupid enough to just cross the river and attack me again. And I think the other general's a bit uh, high level. Oh god, this is going to cross problem. The higher the level they are, the more gravitas, the more control we gain again. God damn it. I do hate the Baltic system in this game. So much. Ready for further orders. For smart is they're not gonna replenish either. Okay, this one next, right? Or not? Good. Right, I got that other one fortified. Okay, now I have to go fleet hunting in the deep waters. That's gonna be fun. Now the Athenians are going up to Istra nowadays. That's not gonna be good. God damn it. Great. Pirates are just what I need. Dropping. 
Ready for orders. Okay, so no, he's still there. What? I'm confused. Let's uh, we get the spy back down here. Yo, their armies are on the run. Good. Would be funny if you can still block armies with agents like you used to be able to in room one. None will escape indeed. You bastards. Oh, I was thinking this guy's is gonna make it over there. Minus five campaign movement range. So we're gonna take that next turn. Let's see. Problem with these guys, I uh, have nothing defending this area here. So let's see if we can actually piece them out. After that stupid attack of theirs. Well, and we can. Yeah, fuck you. My time is better spent feasting and ha speak quickly and well. I am sure you have many pleasantries. You know, the British want to trade. That's that's wonderful. What you guys? Uh, who else am I missing here? I'm gonna need to move into Britain as well. At least that's gonna be an easier job to wipe out. We take this first province, make one military building there, and the rest will, will fall easily. <clears throat> this is going up there. That's not good. Let's secure loyalty. Basically, because of this motherfucker here. I can't really expand too much because he's gonna hate us for each province that doesn't have a majority Roman culture. There shouldn't be too many of them by now. Let's uh, fight this and see if we can piece them out afterward. Should be able to. What's the losses on this? 85. Acceptable. Then it killed off both the other armies. Good. Well, this. Uh, let's go. Which one do we go for usually? I think it's the Romanized capital, right? That's in right count. Uh, Wait a minute. Romanized provincial capital. Yeah, the one that gives us research rate. Although research rate is not that... Uh, not that critical at this point. Now oh, let's stick with what we used to do. There, maybe you're gonna need to help out a little bit. So, okay, so he is gonna be to take that, and we're gonna piece out the Epirus for a while. As if. I'm gonna need to destroy Sparta somehow. Your 
I'm thinking going down here and taking that. So we have a foothold. I guess we can switch these two out. Okay, there's an Emperor's fleet somewhere over there. You're finished. Come here and hunt this down. Ready for orders. We hunger for battle. This guy is almost in place. And this is not gonna make a big difference. This kinda will. Not that much. Actually, no, let's not tax it yet. Let's see how long till we hit the. Oh god, it's gonna take a while before we hit the next uh, Imperium level. Minus, seven, minus 30 loyalty for all political parties. Destruction cost, diplomacy, public order, penal oh god. Large increase in influence per turn for your political party, political action cost. Ah, oh, jeez. You almost don't want to expand because it's so freaking crippling. The public order is fine because I'm um, a normal tax rate as well. Let's send a couple of diplomats out. Let's see, let's send one to Pergamon and one to Rhodes. Loyalty. Get some loyalty from him. Let's save up the money because I'm gonna need to spend a lot of it next turn. These two, right, they didn't attack this one because it's actually in a fortification stance. And they're gonna get reinforcements as well. Look to the defenses. We'll see here. Uh, See, let's see, campaign movement range. Should be it for that. Let's actually go out a little bit. Oh, that's nice. Are they at war? They are not. Wait a minute, those are the wrong one. Wrong ones. Are these guys. Fuck you doing over there. Why they are passing to Germania? <laughs> I don't have a virus anywhere. I hope so. Press it and increase foods in Rome. That's that's something. Well, let me check if there's any settlements that don't have enough food. I 
Okay, that should sort some of it out. But let's uh, make another one just in case. I should have enough. I mean, these are minor bonuses, but like 3%, uh, it makes a difference in the end. What's up, Sludge? No long day? Of course there's no Carthage. Carthage is the first one to fall. That's why the series was called Car the Carthago de Lenda Est, after all. May Athena and your ancestors give you wise counsel here. They will, I am sure, remind you of many considerations. Wait a minute, so if I d no, 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 fuck you, you fucked up, I'm not gonna make you a client state. That went well, well for me last time, with the uh, Massalia. Granted, when they did betray, I, betray me, I just wiped them out in like, three turns, but same thing. Oh, you sneaky little bastards with your fucking fleets. Oh, fuck. I need to check why this uh, town is usually losing garrison troops as well. well this is not really going to be winnable. Yeah, pirates are a thing. They're annoying. It's all hell. The fuck? Players can take cities or ports, port cities, what? Villages? Well, that's what I need. Oh my god, no. I didn't sell the capital enough. Surely, yeah, that's it. Yeah, that that's, could be it. Probably. Wait, is that the... Uh, yeah, this... I even built it up. Silly me. Should have salted it a bit more. Uh, apparently, Egypt gave me another city. Which... Uh, general tribute... Wounded. Oh god, more pirates. Oh, for fuck's sakes. This is how you conquer the, like, what, we got this, this. We got all four of these, I think, from Egypt, from just sending diplomats over. We got Memphis, and we got, uh, Diospolis here as well, from just sending, uh, people over. Only enough. They're gonna be so pissed. I assume I can get this as well. But probably not Alexandria because that's that's their capital, right? How about you guys? Do you wanna trade? Good, that means they're gonna attack me. So wonderful. You sneaky bastards. Hey. 
pieces of crap. Okay, you... You just stay, like, right in the middle there. It would be cool if we could like set up a blockade that like blockades this area here completely. Ready for it's gonna take two turns to get over there. On the move. At your command. Ready for orders. Waging more and more costly wars and don't have any benefit, right? Yeah, so look at these debuffs, man. The higher your t the more territory you got. Minus 30 loyalty to all public parties. 80 diplomacy with the factions. 25 construction costs to all regions. 25% public order penalties due to the uh, presence of, of foreign cultures. Increase uh, in the amount of influence you get, so you're gonna always like be up here. Tyrant over the Senate. Uh, 144 political action costs, 45 political incident occurrence, 15 recruitment costs for all uh, army units, 15 upkeep, 40 empire maintenance. Uh, what, what else was there? Right. Plus this. Look at the, look at the debuffs here. Minus 12 public order, expansionism, minus 5 to poli uh, diplomacy. I said, uh, research trade is not that tax rate is the only good thing here. Political party action cost twenty percent morale debuff though, but uh, that's it's the worst. Morale is the worst. Morale is the key to winning this game. Oh, yeah, would be amazing though, long if they ever like patched Latin in into the game. That would be amazing. I don't feel like fighting this battle, to be honest. We fought enough of those. I asserted my dominance move one too many times. At your command. Let's see. Is Emperor's gonna accept a client state? Or to become a client state? Do not waste time on ill chosen words. They will not. Two bathing would have been useful. But they will accept the beast treaty. Really. Can I do <laughs> Well, these are supposed to speak Greek, right? They're Hellenic. Oh my god, Egyptians are actually starting to like me. How much money do you want for a trade agreement? That good enough? Yes, good. I will speak for Pharaoh, the lord of the two Egypts, and give voice to his acceptance. I'm gonna need to send two armies down here to mop these guys up, definitely. They're at war with uh, they're at war with Egypt, Pergamon. Why the hell not? I think I do have to oh god, it's gonna take for fucking ever to get down here. Uh, fucking hell. I don't see one of those factions. I'm gonna need to take these guys out as well, am I? Wait a minute. Yeah, see along. Is the scene Latin by? What is Latin for like by as well? Uh, fucking forgot. Should be able to hold this area, this whole area, with uh, unless there's another nail, uh, like uh, sea settlement here, coastal settlement. Should be able to hold this with one fleet. So let's send an army down there. Owly patrols. 
Yes, cross the fucking desert. Take attrition, you fucking dickhead. Ready for orders. see something I have one two three armies here I need to move one all the way back actually we do have a recruitment thing here right yes we do two armies up north three here One down here, and two down here, and the rest are governors. Might actually be time to start mobilizing the governors to do something, and I just sit at home. I need more armies on the fronts. Is gonna fuck up my income as well, unfortunately. Okay, knight. Let's see how much stuff you got here. What is useful here? Battle speed for ships. And I don't really need any of those. Yeah, here's a debuff for your infantry. Yeah, that's what I need. I can remove this guy back. One, two, three, four governors down, actually. We hunger for battle. Right, maybe I should check one of them might have died. No, never mind. Ready for orders. Let's place the edict back down here. their minds they want to uh, make uh, want me to make them a client state again we'll see That's your command. what's up Juventus yeah, I'm doing fine Right, these guys are not gonna have any. Yeah, I'm gonna need to move them back somewhere. They should have enough population, right? Let's move them back over this way. Maybe I should have accepted the. Uh, Epirus wanted me to climb Statham. Maybe I should have accepted that, to be honest. How many turns do you got? 
Eight. It is an honor to serve you still need to stay there. Okay, I'm hoping no one declares war for on me from that side. Egypt shouldn't. Let's see. Africa is losing. Jeez. Right, we just fought a battle there, no wonder. Okay, that's gonna be built up. Right, let me check. Okay, I feel I have no clue what's making them lose troops here each day. What is it? The supply issue? No, it's not. What the fuck? Yeah, this guy is gonna be annoying again. Be checking this more often to be honest. I can get promoted or married or anything. I may have ran out. Yes, we did. Yeah, I'm gonna go do something real quick. I'll be back. Okay, back, let's see what happens at the end. Never mind, right, level ups. Yeah, what else do we need? We need that. Pick up the both of these, that's gonna be fine. With tax rate, we're gonna need more money now. 
I go all the way down there. Fight the African tribes. Rail. Maintenance. I think there was another one for maintenance. You mean the full strength of the empire? Well, uh, taking. It's gonna take a while for me to take the Middle East because uh, the Egyptians are gonna be up. Pain he has to fight. They're all over the place and they have a lot of armies. They are, they are at war with a lot of people though. They're at war with Bactria and Seleucids. Problem like I'm I need to like close at least one front here. Because now we have this open, Greece open. Or Dacia as well. Germania and Britannia. I'm gonna need to like peel off a couple of armies and just go knock out the Britannians so I don't have trouble up there anymore. Then I can uh, close the Greek Dacian front here. Thracian Dacian front. Easily. To Constantinople or so. Then, we, then I can hop back over here into Germania, destroy the old earth. I mean, I'm not sure if I want to do this all the way because uh, now it's more of a problem of politics than anything else, to be honest. And the risk of civil wars because this guy is a bigot. For the most part, that's the problem. Patriot, uh, minus five loyalty for enemy army presence on per uh, ter uh, player territory. That's not a problem, but um, loyalty for each province where the player culture is not dominant. Which shouldn't give us that much of a problem, I mean. Oh, they got two provinces that don't have a majority Roman culture at this point. But he's still pissed off. Right, they did destroy some buildings somewhere. That's uh, the Imperium debuff. Basically. Let's see, this is giving us uh, minus 80 to diplomacy with all, exp uh, with all factions. You can't really get them to like you at all. Look at, all, look at all these debuffs, man. Fucking hell. I mean, I almost want to revert back to some different form of government, to be honest. Neither one is going to help us, though. Yeah, lich no. Well, kingdom, uh, maybe. I know, we'll see. grab the empire maintenance for now go 
sorry about that. Just walk past my whole army and just besiege the settlement. The bravery of men, not words, is all that is between us now. We shall have war and victory. Why am I not surprised? Game, show me what the fuck they're doing. Don't just. I got the fleet up there. Got to hunt them down. Now where are you off to? Good, I think we can reach him there. Actually, I'm gonna check with Athens. They might uh, just want peace for money. That does happen fairly often. They broke a trade agreement with me, the bastards. Oh god. Good. Nothing that I care about. Oh, how, how's this? What? Commander. How did they just walk past my entire army? What the fuck game? This, this this makes sense. And they're attacking us with a load of trash as well. If I say so myself. Because we can camp the camp the hill as well. Nice. Legionary cohort. Romans ready for duty. And these guys are fully weathered like the best army we do have. Yours to command. Commander. Evacati. Melee infantry ready. Troops awaiting orders. Equites! Heavy cavalry ready and willing. General! Oh no, they got a phalanx unit. Yeah, those shields ain't gonna help you against the rocks. Equities! Equities! Oh, more glory! 
units has used all its ammunition. Units has used all its ammunition. Oh god, I wish the game lined these up sometimes. Actually, all of you just target the enemy general. I can't catch these guys at all. What's their speed? Seven. Yes, yeah, seven. Unless they're gonna sit there and take it, apparently. For the men, all this grace. I still don't get how the fuck they got past me, but I think that happened once before as well. It just like moved to, to an ambush or something. I don't remember. Run, motherfuckers. Uh, fighting the Spartans is gonna be. Uh, I don't want to fight Spartans. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> gonna be a grind first, to say the least. Should be all of them. Of 
course, the Eagle Cohort took the most damage. What the hell did they get? I'm not gonna question it. Fuck it. What? We hunger for back on the move. Okay, yeah, they left that open, but uh, if I take that, I'm gonna have to go through all this. This one is even worse. That's all they have. They only have to. Uh, Provinces is left. Uh, the cab is upgraded, but uh, I mean these these are decent. If you look at their stats, the barbarian cavalry are usually better though. I mean they're you don't necessarily want them to attack enemy units. You just f literally flank them or just mop them up. This from head to head? What do you mean, follower? No, oh, no, no, this is a single player. Although playing Divided Impera and Co op would be something. But uh, it would just take too long. This is a really slow mod. I really need a spy to scout out this area. Oh, fuck it. Make haste. Our advance has been halted. Might be doable. The amount of hall plights worries me though. If I could lure them into a field battle, that would be better. Okay. Oh, look at that. Athens is wide open. That's a fucking... Where the fuck is their army then? God, that's worrying. Take out Athens with the fleet, actually. I'm really surprised. It'd be too hard. It is an honor to and we sunk the Carthaginian Carthaginians to a salty death. You replenished. Send you up here. Thankfully, the Spartans in right. Let's check in the. Do they want a peace? Be welcome, and they do not. What about you guys? I will listen carefully to your words. They do. And then give judgment. Wait a minute. Oh, that. W yeah, that's spread out. Awfully. Awfully not good for me. 
We'll see if we can uh, get the Empress to fuck off I will for a while. Carefully to your words and then give judgment. So, greetings and now business. <clears throat> Seems like not. They really do want me to destroy them outright, apparently. I'm gonna be leaving my flank open to the low goals. Ready for all at the stake at your command. I would need two armies here to take uh, the south. Or to want to, yeah. I just need to wait for this one to get units and then turn them back over there. Can you get over there? Should be able to. Well, they're gonna run away for sure, even though they're in a corner. Look at that. So much bullshit. Hopefully the plan is to run away from this army and attack Athens with the fleet and the army. We have a fleet to defend this. All hands to the oars. <laughs> Everyone's getting pissed though. I guess it's my fault that the Baltic parties don't have much in the way of a uh, sway. They just leave them to sit in settlements. But I kind of thought that was going to be enough just because that's what I usually do. With the... Usually when you place uh, your guys in settlements in uh, Attila, that's enough for them. For the most part. I got get a ton of gravity as well from just sitting inside the settlement, governing. Yeah, you're an admiral. This should help out a little bit. Right, we do have someone who's not married here. I mean, marrying my party members is not... Uh, the best of ideas. It's gonna give us more influence. I wanna make sure if anyone dies, I have someone to replace them with. Hiring a politician costs 72,000. What the fuck, game?
spy down here. I don't know where the fuck to go even to get to the places we need to get. Wait a minute. Or EM... No, never mind. It's gonna get taken forever to get down there. And then maybe I shouldn't be opening up up front down there as well. Okay, maybe that's... I'm gonna keep him down here just in case though. guys are kissing my ass again actually let's move this guy down here I don't want any surprise attacks Swift and silent. maybe I should recruit some troops here just maybe have an army ready to go through here be a smart move. Guys standing there. Actually that doesn't make him in get him into reinforcement range. Should be fine for that. I need to improve relations with this guy again. To the Egyptians, you go to the Rhodesians, and we don't have enough money. Or she doesn't have enough influence, I wasn't looking. What's up, cat? How's it going? Funny, I can't remember what the political system used to be. I know it was a lot less annoying than this. That's for sure. And funnily enough, uh, a lot of enemies are at war. 
or other factions are at war, but I don't see them actually taking or losing losing anything. Egyptians especially. Seems the air just sits there and does nothing. Oh god, did they demoralize my ass? Points progress. Let's see if... Oh god. Uh, the campaign plan was basically to take uh, the territory that Rome had in its eye. You know, in its peak, at its peak. But politics is kind of making that difficult, to be honest. Regroup and fall back. A nice place to retreat to, you fucking moron. Basically, the politics are uh, starting to become annoying. Yes. If I win this, that's gonna be something. Maybe I should have fought that first battle. I did make a quick save. Let's see the terrain here. I got so many debuffs from the politic side of things, the Imperium and uh, like uh, the control over the Senate. Can we get up the hill first? <laughs> Should be able to though. Evocati! Evocati! Eagle cohort! I may like without and uh, fight the battle on the other map. Oh, oh yeah, fuck this. Fuck this. Pathfinding is gonna get screwed up from a little rock in the way. I wanna deal with that. Not now. Yeah, I'm fine. For the most part. With rainy here. Not, well, I mean, it's better that it's a bit colder than like 30 plus degrees, which it usually is these days. I did have uh, one of their arm armies just pass me by as well. Okay, so you see where I am. The problem is I have like a front up here in Britannia. I'm just, you know, it's only a matter of time before they attack me. The Germanic tribes also might attack. Everything, everything's gonna attack me basically at this point because of the debuffs. Minus eighty to diplomacy with all factions. I mean, that's a tad bit much. In normal Rome, let alone well, actually, I don't remember what the debuffs or are the debuffs that high in normal Rome, to be honest. See, hopefully we're gonna, we're gonna be on a grassy field or on a plane. Plus, if we fight here, the reinforcement armies can come from this way. Look at that! One fucking general just came out of there and attacked me. Oh, the AI knows. Okay, this is a bit better. I think I'm going to be able to win this just because this army is the one that has a lot of infantry, or just all infantry. No skirmishers.
They had to choose fog, did they? Proud Romans all! We await your command, sons of Mars! Melee infantry! Romans ready for duty! You gonna play Rome 2? I mean, it is one of the easier Total War games, but you can install the Vida in the Pera, the mod I'm playing right now. Makes it a bit harder. Understood. Hold. It is still buggy. I just had uh, like an army sitting by a settlement and the enemy, enemy just gone right past them and besieged the, besieged the settlement. Literally just sat right next to the army and besieged it. Which shouldn't happen. Oh, their reinforcements should be coming from here, if I remember. Now, the ideally, I don't want to attack them right there because they're phalanx units. The eyes of the Senate and all Rome are upon us today. We must make them proud that we are their defenders. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Our Roman guards are... Okay, never mind. They're coming from behind my ass. That's nice. Let's leave a little room to flank. That's one good thing, I think, uh, in the new Total Wars, it just actually tells you where the enemy is going to come from. But just, like... I guess since we were standing, like, this should have come from here, at least. Not from our backs, definitely. Actually, we just, uh, s just rotate there. Should be... Should be close enough to fire. I guess I'm gonna have to leave like two units to deal with this guy. You know, I need to find the heavy hot plates. I can actually remember what they're called as well. Yeah, I think it's these guys. Oh, wait a minute. What? Yeah, very heavy phalanx units. They're actually not in range. Uh, I guess I'm gonna bring my infantry a bit back. I shall send two of these to mop this guy up as fast as possible as well. Good, their commander is on the ca is a cav unit. He might just run into my troops and die. That's gonna be good. Field artillery awaiting orders. Come on, what you waiting for? You outnumber me by a shitload. I can pick them out already. They're more tightly packed, the heavy phalanxes. Our hidden units have been they do have a lot of, like, uh, garrison trash. Yeah, thanks for the good luck. Yeah, only Mars can save us here. Thanks for the follow, by the way. I 
my god, I'm gonna need to inch these forward all the way, am I? One of our units has used all its ammunition. Okay, no, never mind, they're coming at us. They do have a lot of watchers. Well, uh, my only saving grace here is that they don't spread out, which they are looking like they're gonna do. Because you can't beat the phalanx straight on. You have to flank them, of course. So let's see. Medium phalanx, medium, heavy, heavy. You target that one. Guess you shoot here, here for now. I'm gonna smash these real quick. And I'm gonna need all my units to flank all of this. Jesus Christ. I should have sent a spy and I didn't. Of course not. I mean, I knew they had an army there. Maybe I should have fought them in the settlement. I can abuse the AI in the settlement at least, somewhat. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Buffs are gonna hurt. Come on, get out of there. Yeah, that's what I mean. They can, they can pop all my infantry. That's not good. And they have a ton of washers. And sometimes the enemy just squeeze through your lines, like, you know. Yeah, look at that. Could you, could you not? General. Okay, those are broken, so let's uh, get these guys here. Back here. Yeah, look at it. These guys are going for my artillery and they're just gonna squeeze through the lines like nothing. And these guys are not gonna do anything. There's no point in moving them. We await orders. The brave, ready for orders. Actually, you stay there and mop them up. Just go for their general. Taking out their general should be easy enough. That's gonna that's the only thing I think they're gonna save me this time. I'll manage to take him out easily. Okay, look at that. Stop squeezing through. Come on. Slinking through. The enemy general is dead. Okay, he's dead already. Nice. Our general 
is under attack. Of course he is. Where's the other one? Ah, there. I'm gonna need you to come here, help out. I'm gonna use the cat to smash the rest. Look, these guys got enveloped. Kind of. Good, they're peeling off some of the units. Those guys broke. Good. They come around. Now don't you worry. I managed worse. Trust me. Guys are getting caught. That's not good. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Equities! Equities! General! Hey, look at that. Uh, I guess I uh, can just tell these to move out of the way. These are guys are acting as bait, more or less. Another general dead. Look at this. Oh, this. This is gonna be annoying. Look at that. Ooh, I do love it when the enemy just walk through my lines like they're fucking butter. Like ni hot knives through butter. The le Legion cohort is gonna fall though. Unfortunately. They finished up those guys apparently. The men are wavering. Yeah, the middle line broke. That's to be expected. Are the heavier melee uh, inf oh, missile units. Let's see, I'll try and break some of these over here. Oh, heavy melee, never mind. Don't get stuck on them. No, 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 no. Don't do that. is gonna do is just uh, slow me down a bit yes, but uh, if I uh, the only pro I guess the only problem here is gonna be I'm not gonna be able to like wipe them all out so we can actually take the settlement right after unfortunately Oh, 
Although we are going to be able to take Athens, I think. Okay, you come down here. Yeah, okay, there you go. Easy peasy. <laughs> now let's try and mop as much of them up as we can. Uh, my generals do have a perk, which gives them gives the enemy a debuff in morale, like I think 10-20%. So that's what's saving my ass here. I mean, uh, these guys did lose a lot of troops, but they're still alive. I mean, uh, look at the stats. They're all like gold chevrons and all that as well. Militia. That was not fucking matter. I catch him. Just because they're there. Yeah, that's what I mean. I'm not going to be able to wipe them out. And these trees ain't help helping in one bit. Well, that's how it's done. Our hidden units have been discovered. I did pull it off. That's the end of the battle. You may be a bit behind on the stream. It's a bit. Six thousand kills. Look at that. Carthaginians come. Oh, not good. <laughs> Hellenic scum. Hey, what the f where the fuck are you? Uh, I guess, yeah, leave your city wide open for me. That works. Easy peasy, man. Someone died of old age, yep. What's actually Julia, Julia? I do have a YouTube channel. I do stream I do all stream. I stream on uh, Twitch and uh, YouTube at the same time. 
Uh, once I get some more time, I might make like highlight videos or something like that. Like the the first part of this was uh, taking out the Carthaginians, of course. Let's see, can I? Is there anyone from another party I can recruit? Okay, Junior, I think it's not mine, right? Cornelia, Let's grab this guy actually. Yeah, where where was this army? Oh, those ones. Uh, currently playing Battle Lord than this. Trade you. Was thinking of, uh, was gonna play uh, some uh, Sid Meier's Pirates. I'm gonna also do some other Total War games. There's one viewer that wants me to play the Shogun 2 Lord of the Rings mod, which I was looking into. I just need to learn how to play it still. Okay, you guys. Fuck the, fuck the Athenians up. Or just uh, besiege them for now. They're not going to be able to take this. Especially with the fleet there, so... Um, thanks for leaving this open. I'm still in college, I just need a... Uh, I just need... I have three more tests and after that I'm gonna be free. For a while, so I'm gonna have more time to stream and do stuff. And there's a lot of games I have to get to. Wait a minute. Oh, they sell it out. Yeah, let's not camp the bridge. Let's leave them behind. Them. Leave these three. Eagle cohort! We await your command. Look at that. Easy easy. Might even do some Warhammer 2 Total War. I do, I do like playing with the radius mod, makes the game so much harder and more fun. But because I win, in this, I am the same as any other soldier. I prefer victory to defeat. Today, together, we shall have victory. I'm just gonna wait for them to come at me. Fuck them. I do play a lot of games, honestly, uh, depending on uh, what I like at the moment. New Warhammer 40k. I might be playing a Warhammer Space Marine a little bit. The co op mod, uh, what the. Uh, Exterminal? No, wait a minute. Uh, yeah, the last stand kind of thing. A friend of mine. So if you're in Europe, you can join us as well. Might also be doing a... Dawn of War 2 playthrough again with the Wrath of the Blood Ravens mod with them. If I can get him to get play that. Four enemies. Can or can't run it. E or if your computer can run. Um, I mean, it's pretty old. It's a pretty old game by this point. I'm questioning my use. Of, uh, they get sometimes they get 400 kills. Questioning my use of. Um, Catapults at this point. Forward. 
what you want. Units has used all its ammunition. Ready and waiting. Actually, your flank. Commander. Evocati. Brave Romans to a man. Equities. One of our units has used all its ammunition. I mean, flank nothing. I don't actually work. I'm in college right now. Wet clinic. Nice. At least I think that's a nice job, right? Got to help, get to help animals. No, no, I don't. I'm at college now. I did finish uh, or graduate high school for art technician. Was uh, That was a mistake. Art is more of a hobby than a job. You can't really live off of it. Uh, I am studying ho uh, hotel management. I feel that's going to be around forever, so, you know. One of our units has used all its ammunition. It's been pretty slow. Uh, well, there's a lot of people here who bought, uh, bought a bunch of anim- Oh, God. No, 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 no. Stop, stop, stop. There's a lot of people who, here who bought uh, dogs just so they can, <laughs> when the corona lockdowns were in effect, they bought dogs so just to, so they can walk them, which was funny. Uh, like I would go to work, I was working at that point at uh, night, there was just a million, uh, like one or two dogs, ten, per, ten people around them, just like walking the dog, yeah, the, ten people need to walk a dog. That's funny to see. Although I might, I might pause college for a year after I finish this up. Uh, I feel uh, the economic, well, the economic disaster is already here. It's gonna be getting even worse. Hoes and feats. Are you a hobbit? That should be all of them. No, no, you can chat. Whatever. I don't have any rules. When they only killed four of us and 24 of us, uh, 24 of my guys died to friendly fire. <laughs> uh, fuck. My tail picks. I don't know. Guess when I get monetized on YouTube, right? Yeah, let's just occupy this. Oh, there's their army. I knew they had an army somewhere at least. And even... Oh, I know why. Uh, they're at war with uh, these guys. Right? No? Wait. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's the same thing. Well, they're fucked now. I guess I can finally show off the map, right? So the idea would be like to, you know, take the stuff that Romans had. So the Middle East. 
up to here to Dunov, I guess. Or Danube. And this little bit here in the south of Britain. We are already on the what uh, what turn is this? 289. This mod is a lot slower because um, it has a population system like the old Total Wars had. And like depending on how many patricians, plebs, and uh, platari and everyone else you have, it depends on uh, what can you you what you can recruit. Long Rome, it's cursed yet. Like depending on uh, like the population of an area depends on what you can recruit. Like if you get in here, like if we have 700 patricians or plebs, we can only recruit 700 cav units. Or, uh, well, two, three of these units, basically. These are plebs, these are proletari. Let's go for the veterans first. So it makes uh, the, the, the progress a bit more difficult. The public order is also a problem. A whole, a whole lot of a problem. Right, I need to... Let's not place him there. Let's place him here. I mean, the populations in Rome are fine, I guess. We are losing a lot of uh, Ploritari. But I guess plebs. Patricians are good. I mean, at this point, po populations are not a problem because I can recruit everything just from mainland Italy and just move them wherever I need to. But I still have problems here in Africa. Qualar is the main thing. And I kind of don't want to take the time to like figure out which buildings I need to create so the squalor isn't the problem anymore. Basically, the only thing holding uh, holding me back right now is the parties. Let's look at that. I was in here for a while. To minus twenty morale. That debuff is so fucking annoying. Now I basically spend most of my time just uh, trying to get uh, you know, the faction uh, parties, political parties to be nice to me, I guess. You could say. You get a wife. Maybe I should take a look at these xenophobe bigot. Let me check if we can promote anyone. Africa is Africa. You mean Carthage is Carthage. You can never get rid of the Carthaginians. It's so freaking annoying. The pirates keep popping up, right? I can promote anyone here. What's even worse, like to hire a politician. Look at this. Look at the cost. 75,000 denarii. Granted, if I do push my taxes up, we can get uh, 85 per turn, but uh, we do have public order problems. These guys are in range of this. Yes, they are. Okay, we're gonna take Athens next turn. Unless these somehow make their way here in one turn. They shouldn't be able to, though. We hunger for battle. And plus, you can uh, if you you don't have enough troops or the specific uh, class 
or population there. Like, see here. You cannot reinforce your units. So that's another thing. Public forum. Oh, these are just building, right? Representation. Maybe I should go for these, to be honest. Ready for battle. Thankfully, this is not a coastal settlement. That would be awful. Troll. You just get back there. Yeah, the, the, what's funny here? I got all of this, the whole province, and these two by sending diplomats to Egypt. And they scored me this. Okay, which one do I usually go for here? The Gyre Mine Complex. The balloons. <laughs> uh, I wish I could. The problem is these days, I don't even know my credit card number anymore. Like, the card is so worn, I can't see three of the numbers on it. And I didn't write them down. So that sucks, I need to go another year. Like that. I guess I can go replace the card, right? I don't want to, though. Great hub, fortified small town. Uh, let's see. Five swordsmen, five town guard. Recorder. Let's go for that. Yeah, that does look weird. Weed. And plus, uh, in this uh, in this game, in this mod, you don't want to keep your uh, armies inside of settlements because they ruin public order in there. I kind of want to attack this, but I do kind of still want to fix this all, all these up first. Which one the fuck? Which one did they go for here? Fuck. have to spend some time in the politics screen. Actually, let's do this first. Maybe we can squeeze another settlement from Egypt. Now let's see. What do we need again? We need praise. We have enough money for that. Thanks for the sub. 
wrong button. What do you mean? Jesus Christ, I swear. They made the politics too fucking complicated for this. I feel like I'm playing Crusader Kings more than anything else at this point. Praise. Thank God, finally. And of course, you can't praise either of them. enough for now. Let's save up some money at least. No, I did play it and it's like it's a cool at the beginning but later on once you go get a million kids and a million relatives it goes to shit real fast. Okay, I'm shit at the Is there nothing else? Navy battle, so let's do that. I forgot to move the navy there. I may have. But oh, come on, Spartans, fuck off. Do something useful for a change and go fight some barbarians from the north or something. Actually, it does seem like it's gonna be easy to take out the guys above me right here whatever their names are Internal loading times can be uh, a bit long. Just a bit. Tribute, good. Another one. Four generous tributes, nice. Child has died. Get us an army, get us an army, get us an army. That's the problem, yeah. Like supply is a problem here, right? Yeah, it is. I mean, I guess I can move the armies out of there. Let's see. Fly pit. Gladiators. What does the butcher decrease banditry? That makes no freaking sense. Wait, no, that's not the one. Yeah, the butcher decreases the band tree. Which, uh, fuck if I know why.
Let's go for the sacred girl that's gonna give us the most uh, of the coda. Your daughter is uh, with a child. She swears she has never known the touch of a man. And believes that the child is a gift from Mars, the god of war. Of course keep the child. I see a cat. This guy's literally raiding Athenian land. Oh, that's funny. That's fucking funny. Okay, we already got a barracks here. Unfortunately, I can't reach him this turn. Your next command. I mean, I'm hoping they can get over there in one turn. Really? Now, I could possibly win this if I resolve it. But let's, uh, I'm going to lose a lot, so let's not do that. I could just bring another fleet in, to be honest. Let's grab all the stuff that doesn't increase the upkeep of them. Stacks, right? Ready for battle. Mm, let's see what else do we need here. Replenishment would be nice. And it could be a good idea to go for night battles as well. But uh, buffing it. all the units would be good as well. So let's take that. want to go into into that territory really don't want to but we may have to god I wish I can raise another army I kind of wish these guys attack something at least not just sit there And I need to check the rest of the fleets. Yes. This one good. This one get could sit in there for a turn. These guys got seven turns of rope. Yes. No supply. These guys are just looking at the barbarians there. The Germanians. Eyeing them up. Okay, yeah, this is going down, but the green party, the optimates. If I'm gonna have a civil war and they're gonna take half the land again. That's gonna be fun. How old are you? Could you die off? Please. Oh, that's funny. 
These guys hold like 3%. No senators, no nothing. I don't wonder why, though. I may be missing something, to be honest. Missing something so obvious. I do have an idea. Where is he? He is a uh, admiral in Apollonian. Your orders. Yeah, this guy. I do have a plan? I replace him. Julia, 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 Julia. Junior, Julian, Ju oh, like most of these are mine, except this guy. I do have a plan. This is how you usually get rid of uh, political enemies you don't like at all. You just uh, get them back and then you set them off on a mission. Diplomatic mission somewhere and hope they die. Basically, that's how we did. Jesus Christ, Africa. I'm gonna have to destroy one of these. Let's destroy the catapult thing and make uh, something that's gonna boost our public order there. Game okay, Macedonia is being. Uh, we're fighting in there. To be expected. Now, let's bring one army up here and one down here. We sent to Sparta is definitely not gonna get shwacked. Definitely. While we're there, let's see. Let's send her over there. See what happens. Because we have a lot of Imperium, everyone hates us. The more land I take, the more enemies are gonna be willing to attack as it is. Because I spread myself out too thin. Which obviously is a problem. A big one as, as well. I think I should have killed off Epirus. Then, uh let the settlement rebel or something so the Spartans someone else takes it. Yeah. I think that was a better choice. I do love troop morale penalty. Oh, look 
of that nice. Child of Mars, indeed. Okay, who hates us the most? Minus 75, minus 64. The Seleucid hates us the most. Hope you die over there. Ready for battle. On the move. That's the problem here. Ready for orders. You will march till your feet bleed. I have no clue, and we're still gonna lose. Uh, Little troops. Which one is that one? We hunger for battle. Wait a minute. Famous bard. Troop morale penalty. That's weird. These guys are making their way down here. I need to That's knock them out as soon as possible. Don't run away. See, maybe I can take out Athens with two fleets. Yes, I can. Let's do that. Didn't lose any ships. How did these guys take so much damage? It is an honor to serve Rome. Good thing Sparta didn't join him, to be honest. Get out of there, you didn't take any damage. You get in there. And these should have enough garrison to fend off something like that. Not the other one, though. Again, thank you. I'm gonna move this guy down here just because, uh, well, Sparta has a fleet down there. Two fleets there. Side. How may I serve you, treading softly? Treading softly. Doesn't seem like they have enough more armies to actually attack me. Ready for orders. It's part of that province. Unfortunately, I don't want to take that exactly. Right. Um, Dread Commander instantly. here. I think the morale one is going to be the best here. Just because we have so many debuffs. Yeah, 
4% to troop morale. Let's see here. Can we buff that more? Yes, we can. Can place this guy there so they can't attack us from that side, at least. Gonna move these fleets back over this way. One piece now. We are not known as. Okay, there's still one piece, and oh, we can make him a client state. I might, yeah, I might take that offer. You don't have a little Greek blood. There is glory. This is not pleasing to. For now, I just, uh, I just need them to cool off a little bit so I can deal with this. To be honest. Let's see. Okay, there we go. More. Just the two armies I need. Now, I am questioning who do I go for first, though. Taking these guys out might be a little bit easier than going for Britain, and they, they are quite happily sitting up there doing nothing. It looks like they uh looks like they are at war with each other. So hopefully that's gonna keep them from attacking me for a little while. Inferior. Well since we did increase Imperium, that means we're gonna have more problems now. Which is fucking perfect. And we're gonna have problems once this guy gets killed off as well. If he gets killed off, that is. Be night and we're gonna wipe out Athens and this faction over here. What it's called? Koinon, Koinon, whatever the fuck. So it can actually like, um, well, Sparta is completely undefended actually. Yeah, I might move some uh, two armies just to knock out Sparta real quick. You'll leave them up there in uh, Scythian. Yeah, that's gonna be a good choice. So we're gonna deal with that as well. Now this, this is gonna work out. Actually, like build stuff for once. We can place down another edict. I okay, guess it's fairly Romanized, I guess. See who makes the most money. See what's gonna happen with the, at the end turn. 
Well, that's gonna be it for today, I think. So, what's in the turn? Wait, wait, we can have... Right, and I do... We are gonna recruit... Can we recruit anything? Okay, we can recruit two more governors, good. Let's see... Right, we lost Imperium at some point, right? Or, pff, I can't remember. Gives me time so to solidify and take out the Kimbros. the Spartans as well, since they left their land undefended, which is pretty good, if I can get my armies over there in time. Damn it, he lived. Okay, not much happened. Okay, I'm gonna end it here, guys. So, thank you for watching. Have a good morning, good day, good night. And see you next time.